Hi, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to update the firmware on the XMedX Extreme Series devices. After downloading the update file, we need to unzip it. Once the extraction is complete, open the newly generated folder. Inside the folder, there is another zip file which we need to extract. Open the release driver assistant folder and double click on the driver installer setup file. Click on the Install Driver button, and when prompted, click Install. Now that the necessary device drivers have been installed, go back and open the Android Tool Release folder. Right click on the Android Tool file, and select, Run as Administrator. You will notice that the program says, No device found, so in this next clip, I will show you how to connect the XMedX device to your computer. Plug in one side of the supplied USB cable into your computer's USB port and the other side of the cable into the OTG port of the XMedX device. Now that we have the OTG cable plugged in, we need to have the power supply nearby and a small pin on hand. It's crucial that you perform this next step correctly. We need to insert a pin into the recovery port of the device. You will feel a click when inserted correctly. We need to keep the pin clicked into the recovery port and at the same time, plug in the power supply. At this stage, your computer will make a sound indicating that a new device has been plugged in. Also, the program will now say, found one loader device. You can now remove the pin from the recovery port. Now that the program has found the device, click on the lower format button, and wait for the process to complete. Once the lower format is complete, click on Run. The device is now being upgraded. Please ensure that you do not remove or disconnect the device from the power supply, or from the OTG cable.
When the last message that the program displays is download image OK, that means the upgrade process was successful, you can now unplug it from the computer.